Hi, Super Tennis, I'm on your screen again. Day one training. Um, trying to put the tennis ball in the basket to start with my training for today. And the plan is um, to serve, starting with my serve. First, I'm going to stretch. I'm trying to set my camera tripod. And um, after doing that, I'm going to um, stretch which I'm doing right now so please stay tuned and hit the subscribe button and like Tipper Tennis one thing about tennis is you really need to stretch out mostly for tennis players All right? tennis players need to really stretch it's very very important for every training section to stretch at least and later on you can have a full section of stretching but before you get on court you want to stretch out yourself possibly all right so please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like basically i've been um, um, putting my head um, in place trying to figure out um, what are the best activities to do to keep me um, fit so i'm sharing this with you guys hopefully it's going to be helpful for you to also um, do all right to keep the serve kicking in um, i started with the serve easy and slow and also you can see that after my serve i'm having my split step for return of the first ball this is very important okay, because um, one of my um, Slowest moment is me serving and not preparing. Yeah, I saw it in my videos and I'm trying to work on that. So when you serve, probably when you're doing the serve um, training, you want to serve and always speed out to be ready to take on the incoming ball. This is very, very vital. You know, these are little, little things that separate the professionals from the amateur or intermediate rather. So, Stay tuned, don't forget to subscribe, like. I like the Eagles, they are all they are the most company I've always had when I'm training. <laughs> don't forget to subscribe. So to kick starts to keep it moving, I started with the half court rally to warm it up into the um, into the training. So this is to um, get me started working on my movements, trying to pick up the ball in front of me, my eye coordination, body movement. So all this is what I'm working on as I'm hitting, as I'm rallying on the half court. You know, you want to start slow, from slow to high, from low to high. All right, don't forget to subscribe and like. We went on on that side, so I decided to come to the net to do some volley. Volley is a, one of um, the tennis strokes, and um, I'm going to categorize it as an attacking strokes. Right? Yeah, volley is meant for attacking actually. When you come for volley, you're making up your mind. So I decided to go to the baseline to keep it uh, more interesting. Having a rally from the baseline. You know, one thing about the baseline is you want to be consistent. You want to travel the ball back to your um, opponents really, really in a deep um, pace. Right? This is very, very important when you're working it out. Don't forget to subscribe and like. All right. So um, we end it here on the first part. So after this, I decided to play a tie break points play, which I'm going to check out my next post towards the part two super tie break. All right, guys.